What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Flipper Shackley. Welcome back to my channel. Today, coming to you guys, we work out at home, episode 10. I saw somebody, one of my supporters in my comment section, he was talking about how to do wide grip pull ups on a mega bar. I'm about to show you guys how to do that in a second. Also, gonna be a follow along leg workout, five minutes, five exercises. You know how we get down. And also, it's gonna be some more advice on my intermittent fasting and how I actually do it because everybody does it differently and everybody has everybody different everybody has what works for them so I'm going to tell you what works for me and how I actually did intermittent fasting so stay tuned for the full video stick around because it's going to be in different various parts I'm actually going to put the time hacks in the description box all right let's get into it So yes, I'm back with the Mega Bar by Jim Supreme. And this is gonna be a quick tutorial on how to do wide grip pull-ups. I'm not gonna show you, I'm not, it's not gonna be a full workout, I'm just gonna show you how to do it. Uh, the way I do my pull-ups, when I do uh, this normal uh, shoulder, so, shoulder width apart uh, pull-ups, I do them like this, on this, on this uh, the curve here, because I really like that. Um, obviously you can do neutral grip pull-ups here. You can also do pull-ups here or chin ups, either one. Uh, if you want to go a little wide, you just go here. You, you place your hand here for uh, a, like a little bit extra wide, but if you want super wide to get the super wide lats, you have to reach all the way out here to the bar, barbell portion where you would actually attach weights to the back bar. So yes, you can do wide grip pull-ups and I'm gonna show you right here. here we go. All right, so you reach all the way out like this and And I'm talking that's super wide. But for me, I feel as though my wide grip pull-up that I would like, the, the widest I like to go is here. I don't I don't train for super, super wide lats. So simple there. That's what I like. But uh yeah, quick tutorial on how to do wide grip pull-ups using the mega bar by Jim Supreme. Yep, you guys know what time it is. Time to get that workout in. Let's go. Today, like I said, we are going to be doing the leg workout. And it's gonna be following on five minutes. Already got my warm-up done. It's time to get into it. The five exercises will be first one will be normal squats. Second one will be jumping squats. Third one will be lunges. Fourth one will be jumping lunges. And the fifth and final exercise, you will need to share for this one. It's gonna be the split squats, you understand? So what we're gonna do is, you're gonna need to share something to put your foot up on. Cause you need to put your foot up like this, you're gonna be doing split squats, you understand? All right. For the leg workout, like I said, it's gonna be lunges, squats, jumping lunges, jumping squats, and split squats with the chair. All right, so don't worry about the time, it's gonna be on the screen. You can follow along with me. The time is gonna be on the screen like I said before. And let's get into it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, take your time, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, last 10 seconds, 18, 19, 20, 21, all right, 10 second break, all right, 10 second break, we're about to move to the jumping squats, all right, take your time. And jump squats, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. All right, let's take a break. Moving to the lunges. Legs on fire right now. Super fire. Let's go on the lunges. Let's get it. Let's just start now. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Focus on breathing. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. 10 second break. Let's get it. Legs on fire. Careful with these jumping lunges. Make sure you be careful. This point. All right, let's go. Jumping lunges. Take your time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 11, 12, 13, 14, Woo. legs on fire right now, yep, crazy leg workout, if you think you're a monster, get this workout a try, alright, now we're going to do split squats, for the end, alright, let's get to it. One, two, three, four, five, six, switch legs, let's go. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Hurt. Woo. No joke, legs crazy. Crazy pump. <sighs> uh, if you don't work out your legs, you do calisthenics, you're doing it wrong. Woo. Yeah. Uh, legs on swole. That was a quick workout for you guys. Thank you guys for getting the games in with me again. Stay tuned. I'm about to talk to you guys about intermittent fasting. All right. guys so like I said right now I'm gonna give you guys my take on intermittent fasting does intermittent fasting work yes it does it works for me does that mean it's gonna work for you maybe maybe not so I'm just gonna give you my uh, down and dirty of why I started the reasons why I Stop doing it, stop doing it in my experience while I was doing it. So I started doing intermittent fasting because uh, the type of by the type that I am, I can gain, I can gain weight very easy and I can it's hard for me to lose weight. So I implement I implemented uh <coughs> intermittent fasting into my uh, my regimen of what I do to take care of my body and uh, I probably been doing it for like a year, year and a half. No problems at all. And what I would do is usually from like 2 p.m., 1400 for you military folks, till 2000. No, I'm sorry, till 2200, just 10 p.m. for you civilian folks. Yeah, so I would eat in my eating window, and I would usually eat between those times. And uh, what it did for me was, on the other 16 hours of the day, I would not be hungry at all. Uh, and usually when you're busy, you tend not to eat as well. And I saw my my weight stay at a constant. Uh, it's easier to control your your uh, caloric intake during that window for me. Anyway, that's what I saw. And uh, <clears throat> so 
for the other 16 hours. If you get hungry, I would, I would either drink some water, <clears throat> and I would drink water. That would, that would be my, that would be my thing. I would drink water. Uh, some other people I know. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. I know also take uh, coconut, like drink coconut oil <clears throat> at that time as an appetite suppressant. Uh, but yeah, me, I also would chew gum, chew a gum, but uh, suppress my appetite as well. But uh, that's what worked for me. And I have known it for the longest time. Any negatives from it? Only thing is at first, I mean, you gotta build that habit and get into the routine of it, but I don't see any negatives from my, uh, from my perspective. I'm just talking about myself when I say this. You give it a try yourself. But when I first heard about intermittent fasting, uh, I thought all it was was like fasting for religion or some religious purposes or something like that. But uh, that's definitely not what it is at all. Um, so deeper than that, uh, there's so many different uh, health benefits from fasting in general. Um, you can look it up yourself. Uh, if you want, I can elaborate on it. If you want me to continue to elaborate on it, just leave it in the comment section below. What you want me to talk about more about the topic because I know a lot of it and uh, I've done my research, but it's be a, a super long video right now and I feel like I'm dragging it on anyway. So if you want that, I can make that into another video for you guys. But uh, I recently stopped doing it because I've uh, recently uh, changed my eating habits and uh, right now I'm primarily eating uh, vegetables. I'm, I'm primarily eating like a somewhat vegan vegetarian diet and uh i've liked it so far but you cannot I, for myself I, can, I see that i cannot do the vegan vegetarian diet and intermittent fasting at the same time because if you do if you combine the two for myself it what it does is i lose weight fast so if you're looking to lose weight super fast i recommend you doing a vegan vegetarian based diet plus intermittent fasting you will shit pounds like no other uh to be honest I don't think it's good for uh, from the health standpoint because you have to talk to your doctor about that before you do it, obviously. But for um, from the health standpoint, I don't think it's good because you feel super weak at a time. So what I do, I had to stop doing intermittent fasting because if I did that, then I would feel weak and lose all my strength and just not be able to function as well. So that's what I noticed when I combine intermittent fasting along with my vegan vegetarian diet that I'm on now. I'll talk more about my vegan vegetarian diet that I'm doing right now. And I also do like a um, one of those Dana Light type uh, foods that I eat. A full, uh, full day of eating, I'll do one of those videos as well. This video is longer than I usually do. Um, if you like more videos longer like this, me talking and rambling on about uh, certain topics and everything, let me know in the comments below. And I uh, hope you enjoyed the workout with me. This leg workout was no joke. It definitely, it was, it was, it was a challenge for myself. And I hope it challenges you. Um, so the full workout is this right here. It's gonna be pretty much all the workout I just showed you. If you're a beginner, you can do three sets of it. If you're intermediate, you can do six plus, six plus sets of it. And if you're advanced, you can do as many sets as you can until failure. Uh, I, I don't think, I feel like if I, uh, I probably can make it 10 to 10 sets of this. And obviously, you're gonna take a one minute or two minute break in between each whole set of the five exercises. You do five exercises, then you do a two minute break. But yeah, super long, super long video of me talking. And uh, hope you guys like it. I don't like sitting in front of the camera and talking. If you've been watching my channel for a long time, you understand that I don't really sit here and ramble on in front of you guys. But uh, thank you guys for sitting here and listening. If you watch this far in the video, just give it a thumbs up. Cause I, that means you actually had to like the video. Uh, hopefully hopefully I gave, uh, added some value to someone's life out there. Uh, any topics you want me to cover, yeah, leave me in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the continued support along my journey. My fitness journey, uh, obviously I'm still in the Marine Corps. I'll talk more about that. I don't talk about the Marine Corps that much. If you want me to talk about the Marine Corps more, I can do that as well. You can leave a comment on in, in the comment section below and tell me what you want me to talk about with the Marine Corps. Or you can hit me up on Instagram, obviously all my links are in the description box. Hit me up on all, any of my social media. But yeah, so enough rambling on this. I feel like I've done too much in this video. But anywho, uh, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends so they can get the workout and get this value added to their life. And uh, if you uh, have any other topics that you want me to cover, workout wide or anything, just leave it in the comment section below. I said it so many times. And uh, thank you again. I can't thank you guys enough for all the continued support. And uh, definitely, always remember to stay consistent.
Yeah, peace.